Hello, everybody. I've just been to the supermarket. And um, what today's video is all about is combining two really different lovely things into one extra lovely hole, which makes something original and different. And that is what we're gonna be doing with a piece of music. But I've been to the supermarket because of this. They produced rum and raisin hot cross buns. I love rum and raisin. And I love hot cross buns. Put the two together and, oh my Lord. So I'm gonna have some breakfast. I'm gonna have some rum and raisin hot cross buns. Then we're gonna write some music, which brings two completely different styles, ideas, instruments together to see if we can produce something which is really interesting and original, because it's a good way to break out of a when you get stuck in a rut and you can't come up with something fresh, new and interesting and different, smash two things together, we shouldn't be there and see what happens. That sounds also, when I say it out loud, like a recipe for disaster. We'll find out. live up to my extremely high expectations. Yes, it definitely does. Mm. But will the music? That's what we're about to find out. So, what are we going to do? Okay, let's uh, take a look at this little <laughs> template. Template? This isn't a template, this is a car crash. What I've got is a sort of air who type sound, which comes from silk from uh, uh, East West. I've got uh, lap steel. I think that's an orange tree. I'm not absolutely sure though. This is uh, um, the Grand Umbira uh, from Sonicature. Uh, they make really good stuff, actually, particularly the slightly sort of quirky thing. I've got Lab's Music Box, I think. I have. <laughs> got a Bulgarian choir. <gasps> wow! Oh, my goodness, that was so loud. I'm so sorry. That was really loud. All those, all those Bulgarian girls sitting there and telling you, <gasps> you know, oh, no, don't do it, don't do it. Okay, right, I'm going to turn you down, girls. That's it. Best best off that way. Then we've got some ethnic drums. Um, um, but it's not all this. I mean, it's, actually, it's got a slightly ethnic look to it. We've got a battery kit. We've got um, a, a zebra synth. And if I... So it's a pretty eclectic mix of stuff. Um, and I just got to make something out of all this and try and get it all to sit nicely together. I mean, I could add... i tell you what. Okay. Um, it is slightly worldy, so I'm going to just throw in um, some... Uh, let's go for the solo string thing. So then it's got a kind of a nice sort of mesh <laughs> um, between... <laughs> oh, dear. So, but now, okay, here's the thing. Um, when we talk about sort of, oh, I've got this rum and raisin hot crisp one, it's what actually... What they're really doing is they're sort of a swap... Is they're very... It's a minor variation, to be absolutely honest, on having raisins in your hot crust bun, which are all sultanas. So, but the thing about combining different elements together is, if you were to try and put, in musical context now, um, a whole load of basses together, that would give you a real problem because they're all competing in the same space. Likewise, um, you know, there's certain if everything was really high or if it's just percussion just percussion it can be done but it is harder because it's all sort of working in the same space if you simply are swapping out um one element for another element which fulfills the same role so you might say for example i could swap out um this air who for a flute because actually it's doing the same job of the lead line and likewise i could use ethnic drums instead of uh, instead of a kit 
okay let's let's start there let's start there um i'm now going to get my kit up it sounds a bit epic drumish so what we're going to do is de epic drum it here's the mic positions let's make it drier to start with that's better i'm going to turn down the release a bit That's all right. Okay, I'm just going to start whacking it in. Oh, do you notice how? I sort of modifying it as I went on and as you get into the groove of the thing so I'm just going to get rid of the first bit and I'm just going to go with that and I'm stick it on bar one like that and see if it sounds any good that's not very good let's just oh, let's try that okay those all went a bit haywire Okay, look, that, that, that's fine. That first bar is going to work, uh, and I quite like it. And it may be now a little bit too dry. Yeah, it is. I'm, I've shut down the... That's all right. Okay, let's add some... I'm not sure it needs any... How about snaps? That works. Okay, right. Okay, I quite like that. Because it sounds different, it, but it, it, it doesn't sound like a normal... Oop. So I'm just going to move that there and see if the claps sound any better. I do quite like them. Um, and if I turn them down and mix them in a bit better, because at the moment the claps are standing out a little bit, so it needs a bit of meshing. Okay. Okay, that ain't bad. Okay, what am I going to do with this? <laughs> it's all very well coming up with the first bit. Uh, what am I going to do now? Okay, um, um, what are we going to do? Okay, I'm going to play in some lap steel. Here we go. That's all right. It's so... Tell you... For a hot cross bun, this is doing... <laughs> this is not too bad. Um, okay, I'm starting to hear how this is going to come together. Let me now. Uh, what is this air who going to do? It's 
it's not terrible. Okay, um, now let's add some bass. This is coming together quite well. Except I can't play. No! Yes, you can, Guy! No, you can't. You really, really can't. Um, right, let's move that on an eighth. Hang on, what's going on here? I've moved them all in the wrong place. Oh, I'm messing about. I'm messing. Uh, what's going on? Oh dear, come on. Move it on one. That's better. And then do 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 they're all on supposed to be on offbeat and they're not. Uh it would be just so much better just to play it right first time. Um uh, let's get rid of him and move that one. Do 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 Like the offbeat, I'm going to keep the offbeat vibe going. Okay. Um, I'm going to. Th this is not. I'm. I'm going to arrange this differently so things come in at a different space. It's a bit ambient, that. Uh, have I got the... Uh, can I... Mics... What have I got here? I'm trying to find a way. Pick up. Delay. Attack. Release. I wanted... That'll work. Okay. No, it won't. Try something else. Um, I'm not sure how I feel about that. No, I'm not sure how I feel about that at all. I mean... It's very slow to speak this this sample, and um, so it's quite hard to keep it in in time. Dun, 
So you end up going in and faffing like this. Uh, which isn't ideal. You, you can read it after a That'll do. Okay, let's unsolo and see how it competes with the rest of the team. Sort of, yeah. What do you think? What do you think? What do you think? Would you? Really? Okay. Um, Bulgarian choir? That's bold. It comes in second time round, doesn't it? I think, okay. I'm, this ridiculous bit. Okay, let's just have a little look where we are with all this, because it's, it's come together quite quickly, and it's definitely weird. <laughs> um, what are we going to start with? We're not starting with the air who's straight away, so we're going to delay some of this. I'm going to... Uh, yeah, that goes on a nice long time. Let's string him out for a bit. Two, three, four... Then, in comes the choir. <laughs> in come the Bulgarian ladies' choir. Do I need this in here yet? That's it's still not cutting it for me. track delay on that without realizing it <laughs> okay that explains why the whole thing was like two notes out of time that explains quite a Okay, I, in a weird, weird kind of way. I need, okay, I can't just keep repeating the same musical elements. Uh, th this is all working fine. A 
there's definitely uh, some timing issues with that bit but look this is a hot cross bun day so do, are we going to bother with the odd timing anomaly we are no we're not that was supposed to be a rhetorical question Cross buns. Oh, it didn't record. So I hit the magic button, retro record, and it's there. Thank goodness for that. Okay. So we're going to uh, tidy some stuff up. And I'm almost going to declare this sort of quasi done because it's sort of achieved its objective, hasn't it? Okay, let's see what it sounds like. <laughs> Okay, so uh, we need to... I don't know how this is going to work. I like this. Okay. Welcome to Hot Cross Bunland. What is something is sounding deeply off in there? Oh, that is a grand marimba, which has probably had its. Do you know what's happened? It's had this this mod wheel. I mean the pitch bend wheel. Um, because it went dee -dee 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 -dee, and it never got reset properly. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to have a little flick. Here, yeah, let's go into this view, then you'll see it. I'm going to give it a little tiny flick just before we start, so it resets it. Like that. There. I think, <laughs> given how badly that could have gone, <laughs> that's sort of strangely all right. Um, so we combined all these weird and wonderful things, but they all had a function. And to be honest, if I got a, you know, if I got a traditional rock and roll band or orchestral setup and something, and I replaced different bits with normal instruments, it wouldn't you wouldn't have thought oh, anything on. But actually, I think this is more interesting. So I hope. I have inspired you to go out there and try this yourself. 
and put together a real kind of sardines and custard sort of day uh, of a template and see if you can turn out something which uh, would inspire your interest, you know, and take something away from it and go, hmm, actually, do you know what? That wasn't so bad after all. If you like this kind of thing, have I mentioned that it's a good idea to subscribe because we do live events and all kinds of things and you miss them if you're not subscribed with the little tinkly bell thing. Tinkly bell? I can do tinkly bell. Ready? Tinkly bell thing. Like that. Okay. Uh, and there's a link to um, Think Space Education courses and free stuff and all that underneath this. And check us out if you want to do a postgraduate degree in writing music for film, games, television, sound design. We do all that. Um, online postgraduate degrees, uh, which you can study at your leisure, in your own time, fully accredited. 95% graduation rate, 97% satisfaction, all taught by working professionals. So, you know, if you want to learn, come and learn from people who really do it. See you soon. Bye-bye.